B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I want A plus B. Let's talk so much fun. Learn something new every day. Learn the A plus way. Hey, it's time to start the show. Are you ready? Good guys, here we go. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Hello and welcome to A Plus English. I'm Seb and I'm Elsie. So yesterday we found out what Hanami. Is. Mm -hmm. It's a Japanese tradition that happens every spring all across Japan. What do people do during Hanami, Elsie? Hundreds of people will gather in the park、mm -hmm. and have a picnic with cherry blossoms. Yes. Japanese love cherry blossoms because for them, cherry blossoms are symbols of life. Yes, very symbolic. That's right. Cherry blossoms are very important to Japanese people. That's why these flower viewing parties are so popular. People even have to save spaces for their picnic in advance. 对呀，要保留位置，不然会没有哦。Hmm. Anyway, let's see what else we can learn about Hanami today. Welcoming spring with Hanami. I and Patrick are in the kitchen. Are you getting ready for Hanami? Yes, I'm packing food for our picnic. You're bringing green, pink, and white hanami dango. I love this kind of sweet dumpling. Oishi desu ne. I also have sweet sakura mochi. I wrapped them in pickled cherry leaves. Where will we go for our picnic? Let's go to Ueno Park. It has close to one thousand cherry trees. We'll surely find a place to sit. Right, but let's get there early. Will we stay for Yozakura and see the blossoms at night?、Mm, I think so. The park has lanterns that hang by the trees. I hear it's a beautiful scene. I can't wait. This will be so much fun. Yeah. It's like pack wood. Word power. Pack. Pack. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Early, early. Katie had some extra time to study because she arrived early for class. Katie had some extra time to study. Because she arrived early for class. Lantern, lantern. Gary carried a lantern with him because there were no lights in the castle. Gary carried a lantern with him because there were no lights in the castle. Scene, scene. Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. 认识智慧 Wrap. Pickled. So today's article is a conversation between two people. It begins by telling us where they are. The article says, "I and Patrick are in the kitchen." I and Patrick 在厨房里面 What are they doing in the kitchen? I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> I asks Patrick, "Are you getting ready for Hanami?" So, are you getting prepared? Oh. Mm. To get ready for something, 代表的是为某事做准备 Like in the morning,、mm -hmm. we have to get ready for work,、mm -hmm. and our students have to get ready for school. The、mm -hmm. AI, I, 他就问了，你在为 Hanami 做准备吗、mm -hmm. ？So Patrick replies, "Yes, I'm packing food for our picnic." Okay, so he's packing food for the picnic. Pack 
that's a verb and it's spelt P A C K. Pack. Let's find out how to use this, shall we? Okay, so when we pack something, like a bag, we fill it with things so we can take them somewhere. Think about the night before you go on vacation. You're excited. You get all the clothes, games, and other things you want to take. And what do you do with them? You pack them in your suitcase. You can pack suitcases, bags, or boxes if you're moving house. But what are you going to do when you get where you're going? You unpack. That's when you take all your things out of your bag and you put them away. So our example sentence is. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Pack 这个动词呢是包装或者把东西打包。那跟同学们很相关的一个字呢，它有用到 pack 哦，它叫做 backpack， 是个名词，代表你的后背包。那例句说啊 ，Nancy 在去旅旅行之前呢，打包了一大袋的行李。那回到对话里面呢，我们听到 Patrick 说，对啊，我正在为我们的野餐打包食物。He's getting ready for the picnic. Right? Yeah, he is. And we're back to our article. I is excited by this. She says, "You're bringing green, pink, and white hanami dango. I love this kind of sweet dumpling. Mmm, sounds delicious.、Mm. Have you ever had hanami dango, Elsie? No, I haven't.、Mm. Have you? I haven't either. Actually, <gasps> we have to go try、oh. them、yeah, one day. Yeah, we do. Okay. That 这边呢，他就问了，你会带绿色？粉红色还有白色的 Hanami Dango 花箭团子，我爱这种甜甜的丸子。Mm -hmm. Have you tried? Oh, I asked that question. You haven't tried that before. Okay, yeah, we'll、I、do、haven't. that next、mm -hmm. time. Next, Patrick responds by saying, "One of my favorite things.、Um, I have also, I also have sweet sakura mochi.、Ooh. I wrapped them in pickled cherry leaves." Wow, sakura、okay, mochi. Yeah, sounds exciting. <laughs> sakura is the Japanese word for cherry blossom, but it's also a kind of sweet flavor you can find on some Japanese sweets, like mochi.、Mm -hmm. It tastes a bit like cherries and a bit like flowers. Sounds really nice, right? Yeah. Now、mm -hmm. wrap 这个动作呢，它是包裹的意思。那它的过去式跟过去分词要记得重复字尾 p 再加 ed 念作 wrapped、mm。-hmm. 那 pickled。它是腌制的。那 Patrick 就说了，我也有带 Sakura Mochi， 就是樱花 Mochi、mm。-hmm. 我把它们包在腌制的樱花叶里。So Sakura Mochi must smell like cherry leaves.、Mm -hmm. They must smell delicious. Hmm. <laughs> so next, I asks, where will we go for our picnic? Good question.、Mm -hmm. 我们要去哪里野餐呢？ Mm -hmm. Patrick says. Let's go to Ueno Park. It has close to one thousand cherry trees. We'll surely find a place to sit. Wow! Remember the sea of pink flowers we talked about、mm -hmm. on, in day one? It sounds like Ueno Park would be the best place to see them. It has so many cherry trees. Do you think they'll find a place to sit, though, Elsie? I think it's gonna be hard, mm -hmm. but mm, I think they will.、Mm. 那我们这边看到呢 ，close to something 这个片语呢，代表的是接近的意思哦。接近什么呢？某一个数量或某一个程度。所以 Patrick 就说啦，我们去上野公园，他那边有将近一千棵的樱花树， mm -hmm. 我们一定会找到地方坐下的。嗯哼 ，It sounds like I still wants to be sure that there's somewhere to sit though.、Mm -hmm. She says, right, but let's get there early. We will. Um, she says, right, but let's get there early. Will we stay for Yozakura and see the blossoms at night? Yozakura,、mm, what, what is that? Yeah, I think what <laughs> she wants to say is she wants to stay late and see these beautiful flowers late at night. But what are they going to do before that, Elsie? They want to get there early.、Mm -hmm. 要很早就抵达那边。这边的 get there 是抵达某处的意思。Right. So they want to get there early.、Mm -hmm. Early. Uh, that's an adverb,、yeah. e a r l y, early. What could getting there early mean? Let's find out. So when we call something early, we mean that it is before an expected time. Imagine a big clock. Elsie and I are、uh, are going to make plans to hang out at twelve. Okay. 
If I get there at five minutes to 12, that's five minutes before we planned meeting, sorry, five minutes to 12, then I am five minutes early. I got there five minutes before. But what happens if I get to our meeting place five minutes after we planned to meet? At five past 12, well, I am five minutes late. Late is the opposite of early. Early uh, is also used to talk about times of the day. We can talk about early morning, that's the beginning of the morning. Early afternoon, that's just after midday when you're having your lunch. Uh, or late morning or late afternoon. We can use it with late too. We don't say early night though. That's the evening. So our example sentence for early is, Katie had some extra time to study because she arrived early for class. Katie had some extra time to study because she arrived early for class. Early 在文章中呢，当的是副词哦，代表早的或是提早。Mm -hmm. 那我们例句说，因为提早到了班上，所以 Katie 有一段。额外的时间读书，那这边的 early 就在修饰前面的动词，叫做 arrived、mm。-hmm. 那相反 ，late 也是一个副词，代表晚的。Mm -hmm. 那 I T E 呢？他们要早一点到那边哦，然后留下来到晚上看。有咋哭啦？夜莺，夜莺。嗯 ，OK。So um Patrick responds, I think so. The park has lanterns that hang by the trees.、Wow. I hear it's a beautiful scene.、Mm. It does sound so romantic, doesn't it? It does. The park is full of these glowing lanterns. Lantern. That's a noun. L a n t e r n. Lantern. Let's check out what this next word means. Okay, so a lantern is a lamp you can carry or hang as a de decoration. So these are very common here in Taiwan. We call them paper lanterns here. Those are those big、uh, round lights you see in outside temples and outside some restaurants and shops. We can also call these Chinese lanterns、uh, in the U.S. or the U.K.、Uh, lantern is used quite a lot because of it's so it's so、uh, popular in Taiwan. It's used a lot in you know. Taiwanese culture. You have the Lantern Festival、uh, in Chinese New Year, which is the last festival、uh, in the week of Chinese New Year. Lanterns aren't only common in Asian countries, though. In Western countries, we can also use lanterns to go camping. These are camping lanterns, and they're not made of paper. They're made out of metal. Those lights that we hang up when we're outside and we don't have any electricity. During certain holidays, we can also use lanterns. We have、uh, jack-o'-lanterns, which are lanterns we make out of pumpkins. Those scary-looking ones that you see during Halloween with the faces cut out. So our example、uh, for lantern is: Gary carried a lantern with him because there were no lights in the castle. Gary carried a lantern with him because there were no lights in the castle. Lantern 这个名词呢是灯笼。那我们例句说呢，由于城堡里面没有灯光 ，Gary 提了一盏灯笼。Seb, have you been to Pingxi?、Mm, no, actually, no, I haven't. You can set off sky lanterns there. Really? Yeah. You can set off lanterns. Uh huh.、Hmm. Sky lanterns 就是天灯。那我们著名的就是平西天灯。那回到对话里面呢，我们说公园旁边呢、啊，它的上方挂有灯笼。那、mm. and Patrick hears that it's a beautiful scene.、Mm, right, he does. Scene. That's a noun. S C E N E. Scene. And that's a pretty handy word too. Let's find out what it means. Right. So the first important thing you need to know about the word scene is that it has that little C in it. It's S C E N E. We don't pronounce the C in it. It is silent. Okay. Scene, not scheme. So when we talk about scenes, what we are talking about is what a place looks like. So picture a beautiful countryside scene, for example. We might have green mountains, gentle flowing rivers, birds in the trees.、Uh, that would be a countryside scene. What the countryside looks like. A street scene, meanwhile, means a view of the city street. Maybe lots of traffic, people selling street food, night markets. All of that great stuff. 
We can also use scene in lots of other ways too. In movies, a scene is a single piece of the movie uh, that, where there is no change in time or place. So uh, when you're watching Netflix, um, in one moment the actors might be talking in the kitchen and then suddenly uh, it moves to another part of the movie and they're on a mountain. Those are two different scenes because they happen in two different places. Our example for scene is Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. Scene 这个名词呢是景色、景象。那字首的 s c 我们合并为 s 的声音就可以了。那例句说呢 ，Macy 喜爱践行和从山顶上看风景。嗯、hmm. ，I is getting really excited、oh. now. I would be as well. But <laughs> she says, I can't wait. This will be so much fun. Mm. 我等不及了，一定会很好玩。Mm -hmm. It will be. Oh, I wish we were going too, but instead we have somewhere else to go. Where? Where? Well, now let's go <laughs> to our magic box,、uh -huh. and then we'll come back here for our review time. Okay, that's fun too.、Mm -hmm. Magic box, 找亮点。大家好，我是 Celine。你们会怎么说？我到某个地方了。你会不会用 arrive？ 像是 I arrived at the train station before 8 a.m. 我早上八点以前就抵达了火车站。或者是 We reached the city after we drove for seven hours。开了七小时的车以后呢，我们抵达了这个城市。那这些呢都没有问题。但是有没有更口语的说法呢？口语上，我们要说抵达某个地方，我们可以用 get there 或是 get here。举例来说，如果今天你跟朋友约在图书馆碰面好了，你可以问朋友说：“呃，你要怎么来？”这时候我们可以问 ：“How are you going to get there? How are you going to get there？” 或是你要跟朋友说：“你很早就到了。”你可以说 ：“I got here very early. I got here very early.” 那可不可以用 go there 或是 go here 来表达一样的意思呢？哎，这就不一定了。go 代表的这个是强调说去这个行为，但是 get 是抵达，所以意思是不太一样的。当你要说是去这个动作的时候，用 go there 还是 get there 都是可以的。例如 ，How are you going to go there？ 意思呢也是说你要怎么去哪里，但是。如果你要说 How are you going to get there? 就是把重点放在抵达。其实呢，两种说法在这个情况下面呢，没有很大的差别。不过，如果要表达意思很明确、很明确的，就是抵达的话，那就坚持的使用 get there 或是 get here 吧。例如 ，I got here very early， 很明确的就是要说我很早就抵达了，或者是说这句话 She got it there. She got there at 7 p.m. She got there at 7 p.m. 她七点抵达。那最后考考大家喽。Karen 早上九点以前就抵达了。这句话的英文要怎么表达呢 ？The answer is Karen got there before 9 a.m. 你答对了吗？ Wait for it! It's review time. 复习时间到喽。Okay, so it's time to see how many of those words we remember. Are you ready for a game, Elsie? What is this、mm -hmm. game? It's charades. Oh, you're in the game. How about when I hang? Are you good at it? I am amazing at charades. Really amazing.、Okay. You are going to get every one of these. Okay. okay. You want to go first? So, of course, I want to go okay, first. Okay, go first. Okay. <laughs> so the first thing I am going to do is, hmm, let me see. Watch him. Open, put things in. Oh, you are packing. You I are am. <laughs> I am packing a bag. You're packing a bag. Where are you heading to? I'm going to <laughs> see some hanami. Hanami. Okay. Hanami.、Mm -hmm. Hai da bao pack. P a c k. Pack. Okay. Right. Well, it's your turn. It's my turn.、Mm -hmm. Okay. Whoa. It looks like you're looking at something.、Hmm. Couldn't you're not looking at a lantern? Could you be looking at a scene? 
Yes. Told you I was good at this. You are good. <laughs> great at this. 我在看漂亮的景色景象啊。Okay. Your okay. Turn. Right. Let me see. Okay. 时钟，手表。这个是什么？自制的分针。<laughs> okay. So you are. Hmm. You mean you are early for something? Exactly. Okay. Not late for something. Not late for something. Okay, so early. Yes. Oh, so. <laughs> All right. So the okay. last one, the last one is lantern. Mm -hmm. Then we'll let our students do that. Yes. How will you act that out? Okay. Well, I'm afraid we have no nothing else to talk about with Hanami anymore. Okay. You know all about that holiday we now. We have to say goodbye mm -hmm. now. It is time to say goodbye. See you next See time. See you next time. I'm Elsie. I'm Seb. Bye. Bye. Welcoming spring with Hanami. I and Patrick are in the kitchen. Are you getting ready for Hanami? Yes, I'm packing food for our picnic. You're bringing green, pink, and white Hanami dango. I love this kind of sweet dumpling. Oishi desu ne. I also have sweet sakura mochi. I wrapped them in pickled cherry leaves. Where will we go for our picnic? Let's go to Ueno Park. It has close to one thousand cherry trees. We'll surely find a place to sit. Right, but let's get there early. Will we stay for Yozakura and see the blossoms at night? Hmm, I think so. The park has lanterns that hang by the trees. I hear it's a beautiful scene. I can't wait. This will be so much fun. Yeah. It's like packwood. <laughs> Pack, pack. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Nancy packed a big bag before she went on vacation. Early, early. Katie had some extra time to study. Because she arrived early for class, Katie had some extra time to study. Because she arrived early for class. Lantern, lantern. Gary carried a lantern with him because there were no lights in the castle. Gary carried a lantern with him. Because there were no lights in the castle. Scene, scene. Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. Macy loves to hike and see the scenes from on top of the mountains. 认识智慧。Wrap. Pickled.